welcome to Excel Video 251. I'm Nate Moore. I'm sending this from Georgia tonight where I'm in town to speak to Georgia MGMA tomorrow. And if I haven't spoken to your organization lately, I'd love to. We're going to do one more trick with these tabs today. And I've added a couple more numbers to make uh, the example work. On the dashboard tab, see an A4, B4, and C4. I've added these numbers. Over in data, I've done the same thing, A4, B4, C4. Same thing in test, only with 4s, 400, 4,000, and 40,000 in A, B, and C4. Back to the idea of if you have budgets or locations or regions or doctors or whatever on each of these tabs, what I want to show you today is a clever way to add all of the numbers, or you can do a couple of different functions, across tabs, as opposed to trying to write a formula that says equals this, and then we got to go plus and come over here and do this and plus and come over here and do that. I mean that works but look what this formula is doing. See this 700? I did the same thing and let me show you how I did it. If you do equals sum because sum is what we want to do and I want to go from the tab that's called dashboard to the tab that is called test let's say and then what I want to do is, uh, oops, I want to make, and I want the cell A4. So what have I done here? I want to sum from the tab called dashboard to the tab called test. So I'm going to get dashboard, data, and test. And the cell I want to sum is cell A4. And that's how I got the 700. So rather than do a complicated formula like that, especially if you have 10 tabs or 12 tabs, one for every month, whatever you're doing, Rather than trying to click on each one, do something like this. Equals sum, and the left parenthesis, just like every other sum formula you've ever done. And then just do the tab name, colon, tab name, and then the exclamation mark, A4. See, over here I have these three. Data, I have three more. Test, I have these three. I want to show you one last trick, and it's right here. Look at the difference in this uh, formula. Equals sum from dashboard to test. Now, I, it's the very same all the way to here. See, dashboard to test and the exclamation point, it's the same all the way. The only difference is instead of doing A4 like I did here, I said, no, I want to do from A4 to C4. And so now what Excel is doing is it's going to each of these three tabs and it's getting this one, adding all these, adding all these, and it's coming back over here and giving me the 77,700 number. If you've got data on multiple tabs and you need a quick way to sum February in every month, or this doctor who's in the same location on the spreadsheet every month, there's a quick and dirty uh, shortcut that's a whole lot easier than clicking around and doing this, especially if you have to copy this all over creation. Because you could copy this and go, and see now instead of looking at A4, I'm looking at B4 and I've got all of these. See how much easier that is? It's a great little shortcut that I hope you'll find helpful. Thanks for watching.